10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Allumage P120 et décollage. La propulsion est nominale. La propulsion est nominale, le pilotage est calme. Acquisition de la télémesure par la station de Saint-Jean du Maroni. La propulsion est nominale, la trajectoire est nominale. La trajectoire est nominale. Vega C. Passengers CO three D and microcarb shooting across the equatorial skies here at the Guiana Space Center, blazing a trail in the trajectoire est nominale. The range operations manager is telling us that everything is going normally. And we have some stunning images here, Louis. Yes, we're lucky because the, the sky is quite clear to tonight, so we are able to see the show for a bit longer than sometimes we are a bit frustrated when the clouds are on, but uh, tonight is nice. It's La trajectoire est nominale, le pilotage est calme. The trajectory is normal, the piloted Début de la queue de poussée du P120. Is calm. We are burning the uh, P120. Yes, right now we are with a large thrust and the satellites probably feel it, but uh, they are safe inside the fairing right now and we are blazing across the atmosphere. Yes. Trajectoire nominale. If we're lucky, we might actually see the... There we go. We see there the... Separation du P120. And separation of the P120. First Confirmed there by the range operations manager, who has also confirmed ignition of the next stage. Yes, Z40. Z40 for Zephyro 40. Zephyro is an Italian name for Zephyr in French. It's a kind of type of wind. So a very poetic name for a booster, which is quite strong and powerful. Pilotage est calme. He's telling us that everything's going well, everything's going according to plan. I, I'm amazed we're still seeing this beautiful uh, three minutes and uh, into over three minutes into the launch. Very clear that we're looking at the engine there of the Z, uh, Z40 second stage, because of course we're very much in the propulsion phase right now, getting us away from the gravity of the Earth. Exactly. At the top Pulsion of nominal. the rocket, we saw it earlier, we call it the fairing. That's where the, the satellites are presently housed. Le pilotage est calme. He's telling us that everything's going well. Um, fairing, of course, it's an external structure used in, for lots of different uh, vehicles, for high-performance cars, motorcycles, boats, that sort of thing. It's to increase streamlining. He's telling us the trajectory is normal. Petrol heads and bikers amongst you will know about fairings, and in this case, of course, it's protecting Début our rocket de la queue de de Z40. It's an important structure to protect the satellites because, uh, as you could feel maybe here in uh, French Guiana, but also on, on, the, on the live broadcast, that the, the sound of the liftoff is absolutely Le huge. And, uh, it would damage the satellites if they were not protected by this uh, fairing structure. And also, of course, during the atmospheric flight, we need to avoid any friction from, from the air. So. We will uh, remove the fairing once we have reached a less dense part of the atmosphere and that the satellites are, are fine. Separation du Z40. Confirmation of separation of the Z40. Allumage du Z9. La propulsion est nominale. 
Séparation de la coiffe. La propulsion est nominale, le pilotage est calme. Just uh, explain to us what we're looking at here. We've got, so on the left-hand side, obviously you've got the, the, the uh, what's left of the rocket. You've got a black structure, which is the adapter. But just talk us through for anyone who's unfamiliar what the satellites look like there. So the payload is composed on the very right, you see the golden uh, shape, which is microcarb. Uh, got a good view of it there. Because of the thermal insulation, it protects it from the La solar radiation. Est nominal, le pilotage est calme. And then underneath you see this uh, dark blue and black structure, which are the CO3 satellites. There are four of them, four optical satellites. And the white structure which uh, uh, accommodates them is the Classic Airbus dispenser. It's a specific dispenser designed by Airbus Defense and Space in uh, Madrid, Spain. And the propulsion nominal uh, as a prime contractor. It has been uh, very specifically designed for this mission. It's a beautiful uh, dispenser. Of course, dispenser, meaning that it actually dispenses the, the satellites. So it's a holding them now, and uh, they're attached to it. But later yeah, on in they, the... They will release it. Uh, very trajectoire is nominal. Everything's going well, he's telling us. You can see on the top right-hand side there is our trajectory. That's the planned trajectory. The pilotage uh, is calm. The propulsion is nominal. The white cross is our actual position of the rockets, and then, of course, below that, you've got our altitude. At the moment, we're 504 kilometers above our planet. We've traveled 16, uh, nearly 17,000, uh, sorry, nearly 18,000 kilometers in terms of distance. Uh, straight line along the Earth, and we are flying, gosh, uh, 7.69 kilometers per second, everybody, per second, yeah, not quite per Quite a hour. ride. <laughs> yes, quite a ride indeed. Put your seatbelt seat belt on. Yeah. <laughs> yes, indeed. La and trajectoire est nominale, le pilotage est calme. A very nice view there of our satellites with the four CO3Ds looking rather like petals uh, on a flower. Coming up to the next big moment there. On the left-hand side, you can see it, the separation of the Z and F, that will be the Z9. That's how it looks in space. Our, our computer-generated images. Du Z9. And we have confirmation there, uh, showing us what's been planned for the mission. Acquisition de la télémesure par la station de Bermude. Oh, we've picked up the signal at the Bermuda tracking station now. It's a Caribbean island, a uh, very beautiful Caribbean island. I've been there. Uh, so Vega C is checking in and saying hello to the teams there. And we've got out of range of the tracking station of Saint-Jean. So we're traveling north, as we said earlier. Yes, exactly. We are tra traveling uh, full north. So as you said, we are now over the Caribbean, over the Bermuda island. We're heading north towards Canada. And then we will go on the other side of the Earth, let's say. Uh, and uh, we will have this ballistic phase I was talking earlier about uh, with no propulsion. And once we reach, uh, let's say, above Australia, we will acquire again the, the, the launcher telemetry, uh, which is the data it is uh, sending to us. And we will prepare for the separation of CO3, the invisibility of uh, Munersa 